Welcome to another Rent My Drive tutorial and in this one we're going to be covering scheduling for an hourly listing. If you're using daily watch of a video because it's slightly different, click through to which listing you want. I'm going to use this one, as you can see it's hourly. <coughs> and then just to refresh on the times that you can set here, so we'll set this one to be open at say... 8am and close at... 6 p.m. So that. And then before we go any further, what we'll do is we'll just check that those hours I've fed through. I'll do it incognito so I'm not logged in. <coughs> Let's get rid of that. Find a space. This one. So as we can see now, it's only bookable from 8 until then you can book your last hour here. So that's how to set your time for it. If you're going to want to do, say, a Monday to Friday, I'll just throw that move screen for a minute. So if you're going to want to do a Monday to Friday, for instance, I'm going to have to quickly synchronise this calendar. Uh, let's see. And then I'm going to hide this one so it don't confuse it. I'm going to add another one from URL. And that's bringing a synchronization for any bookings taken on that. Add calendar. You don't need to worry about ticking that. And back settings. So we can see this one shown here now. And what I'm going to do is, for this bit, I'm going to create a new one. A new calendar. And I do this. I create a new calendar. So what sign number is this? 37087. Create calendar. Wait for this to click then go to configure. And then make available to public. Warning. Okay. And then public. <coughs> Address in high call format. Bring this to here. Call this. 37087 is yeah. paste that in click save and then changes are saved as we see we can't see anything here and then another place to look at your calendars are here all them on calendars so we can see at the moment the weekends are open so what we'll do again is we'll go and we'll close it for the weekends and make sure we're doing the correct one so we'll Hide that for a moment so we only have these on. And then let's have a look. We're going to say what one today? 17th, 21st, and then choose does repeat. Custom. Sunday, Saturday. Repeats every week. Never. Again, you can expires after how many week, whatever you want to do with that. Oh, it's closed. We're making sure it's on the correct calendar there as well. I don't think this makes any difference, free and busy, but I'm still going to just throw our CD so you can see that's turned up on there now. And then if we, I think we might need to go and refresh that one first to be fair, otherwise it takes every three hours. So back here, calendar, and then save. Then we'll just check the all-in-one calendar to see the fed through. So as we can see here, the weekends are again showing. Even though it does the half and half thing, I'll show you my buy on the front end. Oh, we've got it here already. So let's see. This one. So let's see Saturday and Sunday reserved. And as we go through all the weeks, Saturday and Sunday reserved and only open them time. So that's pretty much how to schedule it. If you have any questions or comments or you need any further information on how to do this, please feel free to leave it in the comments or alternatively email us at hello at rentmydrive.co. And as always, thank you for your time. Bye.